Hi guys, welcome to the vlog. I know I'm looking a little weird today. Maybe a little like a Princess Leia's reject sister or a Kodak Black. I'll put a picture in right here if you guys don't know who Kodak Black is. It's gonna be funny. But there is a reason for this. The reason is, is I went to Walmart a few days ago and I found dry shampoo. I usually use sometimes, okay, here's the deal. Let's get honest. I do not wash my hair every day. I cannot wash my hair every day. If I wash it every single day, it ends up looking like hay. It is really bad for it. It dries it out. It breaks. It makes it brittle. I um, wash it. I used to wash it once a week. Now that my hair is healthier, I use coconut oil in it. It's grown in thicker. It it needs it about twice a week now. Oil um, gets in there. And sometimes I'll actually put too much coconut oil in after I wash it. I'll put, I use coconut oil to make the frizz go away like on the ends. And I'll go from like here down. But I have always been the more is better kind of thing. Um, when using products like this, you think that would work if you just have that little bit more. But you cannot do that with any kind of hair serum products. It just makes your hair look greasy and awful. So I have become addicted. Well, first it was baby powder. I would put it in my hands, wash it, and just tap it everywhere. Baby powder worked great. But then they came out with dry shampoo, which is pretty much aerosol baby powder. You, pr you spray it in and there's no clumps of like white. We put a little bit too much. It's more evenly now because you can spray it. But anyway, boys, Michael is going to be putting up his table router soon, his um, Dremel soon reviews, and I was like, you know what, I'm doing something for the girls. I'm gonna go first because I have it and I'm about to use it. And I was like, you know what, I'm doing it. Why not? And this is a little bit different. It's called Pantene Sheet Day. Sheet. Cheat Day. It is a dry shampoo foam. It is a 60 second cleansing wash. Look at this. That may be backwards. Hold on. It's cheat day. Dry shampoo foam. 60 second cleansing wash. No residue. And then on the back. Cheat your way to a great hair day. The Pantene's waterless collection. Look at that. No alcohol. Sulfates is what is terrible. Um, we'll be here back to life in just 60 seconds without washing. This foaming dry shampoo with pro vitamin B5 and orchid flower works without water to cleanse and refresh your hair from the roots. No residue. Great for all hair types. Usage instructions. All you have to do is shake it, section, dispense, and apply at the roots. Thoroughly rub it in. Repeat for each section of hair. Dry, brush out, style as desired. So, we're gonna do all that. And I am gonna do it right here. I do not care one bit, ladies. You know you need this in your life sometimes. This, something like this would last me a long time. And I don't even know how much it was. I'll have to, I think it was 447. I'm not exactly sure. But you use a tiny amount. Uh-oh, that way? Yes. Ooh, not that much. See, that's a little too much. So I'm gonna, ooh, take half, put it on that. Gosh, I don't even need that much. I'm gonna tiny tiny bit and just stick it right here at the roots and we pull it down I mean it makes it wet it feels just like mousse Wow I'm gonna take Michael's famous comb and rub it in old trusty I meant to buy me a really good brush today and I forgot it I always lose my brushes always people stealing from me I'm just teasing. So, I'm taking what I just lost and I'm putting it right just at the roots. 
Now, you know, they've come out, it's crazy. They have come out with a volumizing. It's really funny. It's, it's a volumizing spray and all it is, is dry shampoo. You're supposed to go and put it like right here and then tease a little bit and then it instant volume and then you brush it in oh wait the 60 seconds was i really supposed to rub it for 60 seconds dispense desire to my and apply to here at the roots thoroughly rub in for each second brush out where's the 60 60 seconds no nope. I guess it'll be done dry in 60 seconds and done. Okay, so let's go right here is the most important part. Tiny bit. <gasps> Ugh, why does it do that? It comes, so you waste it and buy, have to go buy more. There we go. Get it there, pull it down. over here you know it kind of makes it easier that way <laughs> much easier than dumping it in my hand every two seconds now it does not feel like it's gonna not leave a residue this is crazy so I have naturally curly hair I was born with naturally curly hair. Over the years, it is like now naturally wavy. Um, but it is still somewhat coarse. So I have to use, you know, John Frieda Frizzies is my very favorite. If I don't have um, coconut oil. Frizzies was my go-to a little bit after you know when I was younger and I would straighten my hair it looked always fried now that I look back at pictures but I loved it because it wasn't so curly I'm gonna pull it down just a little I mean I don't know if this is gonna work guys this is really strange So weird. Okay. So, what I'm going to do is go away for a few minutes, come back, and see what it looks like. I'll be right back. Okay, guys. This is the finished prod. Duct. Um, I don't like it. It makes it feel weird. It makes it feel kind of wet. One good thing about this is what? Look at that volume. So if you're needing volume in your life, this is the product to get. But it is not a dry shampoo. It did not make my stupid gimbal. Um, but it did not make my hair non-greasy. It made it a little worse, but Especially in 60 seconds. It says 60 seconds. I'm still waiting for it to dry. It's still wet. And it's been at least 10 minutes to do a braid, fix it. Seven minutes, maybe. But if I got a, a hair dryer and popped it out, maybe it would work. But this says 60 seconds. It doesn't work. I am sorry, Pantene. What it did do is make it smell good. Mm, that's a good smell, y'all. Dry shampoo foam. 60 second cleansing wash. No residue. Bull. Thumbs down. Don't like it. May use it just for volume. That's what they should have marketed it as. That's probably all it is. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Um, I'll put the price, overall price, in the uh, description below or on a sticker somewhere in this video. The gimbal has died, and we will see you 
Friday for a live stream. Do you want me to do this? Can I do? I love you.